<laughs> Welcome back. Hey there, YouTubers. Reaching over, grabbing a knife. Whoa. Cut Steven. How you guys doing today? In the you guys leg. doing all right? You ladies too? Yeah. Everyone, how are you all doing tonight? Yeah, let us know in the comments below. Below. This is a special box right here. This is one of my favorite things, even though I really didn't want him to send me this just yet. I was not in a hurry for it. I've been wetting my appetite. And he even said, because I commented on, I think it's because I commented on the Facebook post. Um, I was like, whoa, that's cool. Don't, I was like, no rush, no big deal at all, you know. And I meant that. I wasn't trying to be facetious or whatever. But the man actually sent me my stuff. That I backed him on Kickstarter. And by the man, we mean... Mr. Mike Wolfer. Mr. Mike Wolfer. Along with everybody involved with him, and I'm going to start naming off names because I have a knife in my hand, and people, you better listen. Not just Mr. Mike Wolfer. Not Miss Natalie Jane. Not Miss C.C. De La Cruz. But every one of those people. And if I missed one, feel free to tell me I'm wrong. All three of these people have made horror comic erotica a genre again here i am just stabbing a hole in these boxes i'm just gonna rip them to pieces and say thank you i didn't need them anyway no i'm lying i would never do that i'd grab it and run out the door and drive all the way home <clears> before <throat> i let him do that i would never do that without further said i'm gonna go ahead and cut this box without further ado the dude abides. I love that movie, by the way. Even the movie. All right. Box is cut. Ready to unload goodness. This is a goodness from Mr. Mike Wolfer. And by Mr., we do mean Mr. Because this dude is epic. That is epic. I already see something I like. <laughs> Not even to me, but I already see something I like. I don't even want to open this. Mike, I, just just looking at it, man, you've outdone yourself. I mean, God, the, the artwork in this thing is just amazing. That is too cool. All right, first. Look at that. Here's our bag. And, and when I mean bag, I mean, look at this. I mean. It's like a, like, I don't know, like, like, like a care like, package I mean, type thing, I guess. I mean, so here's like, hello, I'm a goodie bag. Here you are. Very good. Thank you. Keychain. With the widow. That's special. That goes there. That's pretty cool. That's special. That goes there. Now, what is this? Now, what Mike does is he does mostly graphic novels, oh. right? Uh, comics, graphic novels. Yeah. Comics, graphic novels, and they're and like Mike said earlier, Mike, this Mike said earlier, it's a uh, horror erotica. And so, I mean, you know, it's, it's not kid safe, but for anybody that's a collector and likes this sort of stuff, this is all original stuff, and it's it's, it's done by him. I mean, it's, it's original stuff. And some of the stuff that's in this is just, I mean, the artwork is just amazing. Look at this. Look at this. I'm gonna show you these what Mike's going to do with these is he's going to get one of those um, card books and he's going to put them in the, the little individual things and keep it because this is probably going to be worth some money someday. I'm not showing anybody those. I'll let you see that. Oh, cool. Get a window decal. Oh, this one's signed, bro. Uh, dude. Uh, dude. Uh, we know this. We know this. Oh, there's more stuff in here. Again, these are not kid safe. Some of these are kid safe. Yeah, some of them are nice. I'll show you the more kid safe ones. And all this is original art. All this is uh, all him. All him. It's all. Or, look at that. Look at the detail in that. That is amazing to me. Wow. Holy crap, man. Well, you got some good stuff in here, Mike, so far that I'm seeing. This is a decal that goes on your, your window for your car. 
you can't really see it, but it's a it's a black widow spider. See the outline there, and you would put that on your car window or your car. Please sign that one. And that, I mean, that's you know you don't see that around. You won't see those around town. He signed that. That's awesome. Thank you, sir. Not really sure we can we can show this. Yeah, you can. It got no I mean, it doesn't really have anything bad, but you can see you see a little signature up top. That makes it so, so special. All these you we can't show. Yeah. That makes it so special. Mike Wolfer, you're you're amazing, sir. You're a genius, sir. But you already know this. Nothing we nothing we can tell you that it would even you, you shouldn't already know. Yeah. You're you're awesome, sir. Oh man. Look at that. Look at the details. Now I'm I'm very, very amateur artist myself, and I can tell you that I've been drawing skulls since I was little. The look at the details in that skull pile right there. Look at that. I mean, that is just amazing. Look at that art. This is all stuff that at any time, if he wanted to put it in a frame, can't show that one, and, and put it put it up on the wall. This would adorn any wall that was that. To any man cave. It's amazing. Can't show that one either. Can't really show any of those. I can show that one. Eh, I think I'm not going to show that's that. signed too. Yeah. I like that color too. That's a nice color. Beautiful color. I don't know how many with this one was Whoa. made. <laughs> At all. <laughs> that was a. Uh, what, the front page? Yeah. I know, right? That was. I mean, dude, it's like the. Um. Yeah, the whole book's probably like that. The, the inside. <laughs> The inside of the book, we just kind of glanced on the inside of the book. Very graphic. So again, I can show you the regular cover. Definitely something that 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 you know it's for adults. It's it's for your your adult comic book collectors. This is from the Maximum Widow collection. Now what he has here is he has several of the same comics with a different color to a cover to it. Um, different drawing. I can show you the back color. of it and tell you what it says. Oh, I okay. I just Did noticed that. Wow. Say? Yeah, I just noticed that. <laughs> Nude cover. That's all I'm going to tell you. Which it lives up to its name. Trust very, me. very much so. And can't show the either. I can't show you the cover of this. I can't show you the. I can't show you wow. either, either one of these covers. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Do that. It's nothing. Trust me. Not this one. Look, 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 look at this. Yeah. So I mean, this like like we said earlier, this is very much an adult book. Um. However. Again, I mean, the colors on these are done by Cece de la Cruz on this book here. Uh, I can't really show you except for her face there, so I can show you. I don't know if I showed anything else. If I did, I apologize in advance. I did not mean to. That is amazing. I love it. That's just one bag, sir. Yeah, it's pretty amazing. Hey, 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 hey. quit. Down, boy. Just looking through the book. Damn boy. Sorry. Damn boy. Next book or next package. Uh, I know I had this package. Um. Ooh, I like that. Yeah. Ooh, glow in the dark. Oh yeah. Okay, I remember this one. Yeah, I showed you about. You, you showed you me that one. Yeah, I told you about these. Now um, these these are comics. These are actual comics. You can tell. The gypsy. One of four. Now, notice something up in the upper left-hand corner of that. It says, glow in the dark. But it don't glow in the dark. That is absolutely amazing. It's uh, something that if it does is glow unique. In the dark, I'll let you know. But I don't think it does. I mean, it would be awesome if it did. I think these are here like the model. Like, like if you put together the model. Yeah, 70 models kit variant. And this is number two of four. And this right here is Ragdoll. All these are original um, characters made by him, correct? This is all mm -hmm. stuff that, that he's come up with. Not Yeah. Very, very gortastic. Yeah, the cover, yeah. Look at that. The that. lettering is done by Miss Natalie Jane. He is written and illustrated on Mr. Mike Wolfer. Um... 
The ink washes are done by Mr. Dan Parsons, and the cover colors on this one comic right here is done by Miss Cece De La Cruz. It's amazing. Oh, man. I can show that because it's covered. Yeah. And it's number three, a four, and boom. All these are number three of 60 so far. Let me double check. Does it count as Batori? Oh, God. That's it. Nah, nah, nah. I'm gonna get to those in a second. Mm -hmm. oh, man. And Miss Countess Vittori. She is so gorgeous. Oh. Man, oh man. I'll put that down there too. And these right here are Night of the Living Dead comics. Now these I am personally very jealous of because I am a huge zombie Night of the Living Dead fan myself. So, and he's got number one in his hands, and it's autographed on the bottom. You see it right there. And then you got issue number two. It's autographed right here. The details in these are just absolutely. I think these are colored actually. Yeah, yeah, these are absolutely just amazing. Yeah. The artwork in these are just... Wow, I love the wrong page of that one. Yeah. Look at that. That is just... That's awesome. Actually, I probably shouldn't have shown you that. Sorry. What? I didn't realize. Uh, it but it's bloody, so... Yeah. But, I mean, it's, it's the details in it. Anytime you can take a comic book... Issue number three, autograph, right there. Anytime you could take a comic book and turn to any page and you could take that page out of the comic book and, and put it up on your wall and it would look like a, a like a piece of art. Issue number four. I mean, it's just amazing to me. And these are just completely amazing. I'm Issue number five. Extremely jealous. It's okay. Look at that. Look at the detail on that. I know, right? Issue number six. Mike, you've outdone yourself again, sir. Oh, man. We're not done. No, we're not anywhere near done. No, we're not even anywhere near done. And this one here is holiday special number one. They won't stay dead, it says. They yeah. won't stay dead, Mike. They, What's they going can't. on with that? Oh, man, the freak angels. Oh. Why won't the dead stay dead? Because they're dead. Oh. Oh, well, it's, it's wicked. The Walking game, Dead, sir. eat your heart out because you have nothing on this. No, not at all. These are here just the regular covers, too. It's a regular wraparound, gore, and cover. These are here just the regular covers. Which I enjoy those very much. Amazing. What else is in here? Do I have other things in here? Oh, I do have other things in here. Oh, that looks like some kind of print. Is this some, oh, I can't show that one. It's a print that you can't show. Print that I cannot show. Ain't that crazy? Let's see how bad this. Don't take it out. From that website you looked at earlier. Now with the prints, again, stuff like this. I mean, I. I want to show that so bad. I would put this in a frame, and I would put this up. I would put it up on my wall. I mean, that's just it's. It would be an amazing. Should I show that? Yeah, an amazing man cover. Uh, man, man cave. I, I gotta close. I'm trying to close the gap on the nudity part, but look at that. Look at the details in that. They went so far as to as to do a border on it. Look at the border on it. Just the border itself. I mean, it's amazing, Mike. I mean, you're just uh, Mike Wolfer. I mean, I, I I can't say enough how amazing of an artist you are. I mean, that is just amazing. That's. If you look at the bottom, it says three of, 55. three of 55, three of 55. So there were only 55 of these made, and Mike has number three of them of it right here. Amazing. And I have one complaint, sir. Small. Uh oh. Um. I know I backed. I don't know if it's gonna come with the the this widow set that hadn't been done yet, or what, but. I do, I would like to have the number two, three, and four 
of the, I guess you call it the original regular backing of the covers for Curse of the Ragdoll. Or not. <laughs> I don't care. I mean, that's like I said, small complaint, small gripe. Beggars can't be choosers sometimes. Beggars can't be choosers sometimes. Um, but uh, I do, whenever it does come available, I do want a Batori. I do very, very much want a Countess Batori uh, comic. Badly. So badly. So, so, so badly. And I cannot wait for the virgin art cover that you're already doing. Oh. Oh, yeah. I know for a fact that Mike is a huge virgin art cover fan. So, he's probably salivating at the mouth for that one. None of these are going nowhere. I'll keep everything here. With the exception of maybe the Maximum Risk comic. Because I got the same comic already. By this gentleman here, but he probably get trouble by the wife. But who knows? But who knows? Other than that, all in all, this is probably my favorite box that I'll unbox tonight. Mike, if you ever redo any or re put out any of your He uh, does. Uh, your Night of the Living Dead stuff, I would love to know. I would love to get in on that. So sorry I missed it. If I had known about it, I definitely would have backed you one hundred percent on it. So I'm a huge, huge fan on that. So I want some more guys stuff. Is what I want. Night of the Living Dead. Just more Night of the Living Dead, please, please. So other than that, more guys. You're an amazing artist, and your your yeah. artwork transcends anything that's available out there right now to me. You know, um, you're you're. Whenever we talk about artists, your your name is one of the first ones that come up. So yours? yes. So I mean, you're amazing. You're, you're, you're a true genius at what you do, sir. And not to sell you short, but Miss C.C. De La Cruz, I mean, come on. Without her magnificent handiwork with all the colors, his art wouldn't stick out as much as it would. That is true. Like I, like I said, I mean, it's it's amazing artwork. And, and, and that goes, I even say, the lettering itself in the comics and, and the, the other stuff from Miss Natalie Jane... It, can't can't be undone, man. I'm overwhelmed with joy and sadness. Sadness, you ask? Well, I opened it. I have nothing left to open. <laughs> now you just get to read and read and read. With that being said, thank you, sir. Thank you so much. I'm not even going to support anything tonight. No, well, not on this one. No, because you know what? Support Mike Wolfer. Support your local Mike Wolfer. Yeah, support him. Find something that you can buy of his and help support Mike Wolfer. Go on Kickstarter and back him. If there's anything there. If there isn't right now, because I know for a fact there's not, go to your local comic book store and pick up A Night of the Living Dead. I know I am. Or pick up a war goddess number one. He does uh, lady. De he does some lady death stuff too. Yeah, he? he did some of the original uh, stuff of lady death. I think back remember chaos and avatar. I do have some of those. I know in my collection. So, like I said, I'm a, I'm a, I'm a huge fan. I've been a huge fan for years. And, and when I seen his artwork and some of his stuff on Kickstarter, I was like, nah. -uh. And, and of course, it was you. And so I was like, ta da. My world is complete. I get to stock you on Kickstarter. Ta da! <laughs> All right. And with and that Facebook. being said, and <laughs> before this gets a little too creepy, no, it's a joke. I, I don't. Seriously, I, Mike, I do, you're a genius I do at what you do. Post, though, because the band needs it. You're a genius at what you do. Uh, we completely respect your art. And, um, and as a human being. Because you're hilarious. We will, we will, oh, we will also, also support, um, what is it, Hot Squad. That's something he does every Tuesday night. Go to Hot Squad. Um, they have a Facebook page. Um, I think you can find them on YouTube. I even think you can find them on a couple other things as well. Um, hence, I want a Hot Squad t-shirt next time I want to un unbox one of your uh, boxes, sir. Extra large would be perfect. Extra large. <laughs> Let me know where to send the money. <laughs> there you go. Make that too. 
Make the trees. <laughs> All right, folks. This and that being is, said, this stuff is amazing. We're we're not going to uh, close with our normal closing. We're going to we close. We're going to close with our support we your want, support your local Mike Wolfer. Support your local Mike Wolfer. Get on Kickstarter. <laughs> get on some of his stuff. Follow him on Facebook. Follow him on um, Instagram if he has an Instagram or Twitter. Tell him how much does. of a genius he is. Yeah. And uh, poke the ego. Poke that ego. He likes it. <laughs> All right. Give us a thumbs up, thumbs down. Yeah. What, what you think? Whatever. You Comment. Mean. You know, criticisms, whatever. Yes. And uh, we will see you tomorrow. That's you. You. There you are. There you are. Uh, you. No, you. Later. You. you. Tomorrow. You. Possibly soon. Yeah. Um, before you hit that button. Uh-oh. Here we go. There's one other thing. One other thing. It comes right after this one. See you soon. <laughs>